Armenia has already ordered four Swati weapon locating radars worth $40 million and four batteries of Pinnaka multi-barrel rocket launchers worth $250 million from India, and as per latest information, Armenia has now shortlisted the ALS-50 loitering munition by Tata Defense Systems and Nagastra loitering munition by Solar Group for procurement for its Special Forces unit. Armenia operates Russian Iskander mobile short-range ballistic missile system, and the Armenian Prime Minister had raised questions on the efficiency of the Iskander in 2021, as 90% of the launched Iskander did not explode. Kanı bir bana kitsen kusum. Ser sarksan nasume yezarmatsatsem te inchu paterazmi yerort kam çorortor Iskander çikrakel. Iskinchu krakats Iskander çipayte. Armenia has now shown interest to procure India's Prilay canisterized tactical short-range ballistic missile that has a range of 500 kilometers and can be launched from a mobile launcher that is highly capable to target radar and communication installations, command and control centers and advance airfields. Officials of Aeronautical Development Agency have said that the 4.5-generation TED-BF will incorporate all the fifth-generation technologies that is currently under development for India's AMCA stealth fighter program that will keep it technologically relevant even 20 years down the line, even for third aircraft carrier requirements. The TED-BF will incorporate smart data fusion from multi-spectral sensors to provide identification location jamming and decoying against a wide range of threats, that will make it a unique fighter jet among its contemporaries. The DRDO Tata developed WAP will soon be facing serious competition from three more Indian private sector companies. Larson and Tubro had showcased a scaled model of its 8x8 wheeled armored fighting vehicle at the Defense Expo 2022, that is based on a new design, but will use equipment and systems developed by the DRDO. Larson and Tubro officials have confirmed that fabrication of the prototype has already begun, and rollout will happen in 2023, and it will be offered to Indian Army for internal trials. Mohindra Defence has also showcased a model of 8x8 wheeled armoured fighting vehicle, while Kalyani has proposed a 8x8 wheeled infantry fighting vehicle based on the T-Rex infantry fighting vehicle developed by ST Engineering of Singapore, that will feature a 30mm gun, a 7.62 coaxial gun, smoke grenade launchers, and the capability to fire 80 GMs. Tato Advanced Systems Limited has developed a stabilized gimbal for main battle tanks, to enable stabilized sight both for the gunner and commander. The Rajak PGC DNL2 has a day thermal imaging channel and laser range finder, that can detect a tank size target at 8 km, recognize a target at 4 km, and identify a target at 2.5 km. Tato Advanced Systems will complete its development by end of 2022, and it will be delivered to the Indian Army for trials in 2023. Indian Air Force had showcased its Samur Air Defence System at the Defence Expo 2022, which is a joint program of the Air Force's base repair depot with a private sector partner Simran Flotec Industries. The 7 Base Repair Depot has completed work on the refurbishment of R-27, R-73 and R-77 missiles, that will now be used as part of the Samarayev Defence System. Limited induction of the system has been planned, as it has been found effective against low and slow flying targets. New Space Research and Technologies has briefed Prime Minister Modi on its CATS Infinity program, which is a solar-powered high-altitude pseudo-satellite. New Space also released pictures of the recent first flight of a scale model of its high-altitude pseudo-satellite that has a wingspan of 8 meters. A full-scale prototype with 24 meters wingspan is also being developed with Hindustan Aeronautics, that can cruise at an altitude of 65,000 feet for more than 90 days. 
It will be equipped with advanced sensors and synthetic aperture radar, and will keep track of targets in enemy territory, and will also coordinate mission of the CATS Warrior Loyal Wingman Armed Drone. Oh, my God.